All right, part three is creating the background pattern. And we're gonna start by um, practicing on a piece of scratch paper. But before that, I wanna show you, I've already gotten started here um, with the background. And I'm gonna show you a really easy way to make a zigzag pattern. Um, so take a piece of um, practice paper, just copy paper, and um, you're also going to have to pick out three colors in the triad color scheme. So I have this really cool color wheel, um, and I'm, on here it tells me what is in the triad color scheme. Um, and a triad color scheme, as you probably remember, are three colors that are equally spaced out on the color wheel. So I'm going to choose blue green, red violet, and yellow orange. That's my triad color scheme. And so here's my colors. I picked them out already. And they're actually pretty close to what's in the photograph, ironically. Um, okay, now just to make a quick sketch of the zigzags. Um, let's draw some horizontal lines just to warm up and I'll show you how easy it is to make zigzags. I'll just do this with it. I'll do this with the ebony pencil so you can see it better. Okay. And I'm going to copy these zigzags. And as you can see, there's two skinny ones, a fat one, or I should say a medium, and then a fat. Medium, two skinnies. So two skinnies, medium, fat, medium, two skinnies. That's the pattern. So let's see here. I'm going to use this horizontal line to show these points. So it goes skinny, skinny, and this one is the fat one, a uh, medium sized one, right? This one's even fatter. Medium, 